and coalition of youth organizations have commenced engaging major stakeholders in Anambra state governorship election. The group in a store of engagement visited the state commissioner of police to ascertain the level of preparedness for the November 6th governorship election. They admonished the police to be civil in their conduct and ensure that the rights of citizens are not trampled upon. The Commissioner of Police expressed the command's readiness to deliver on its core mandate. They also advised residents to ignore rumor and come out to exercise their civil responsibility by voting. We know that we cannot do it alone. We need that aspect. Yes, the police will, uh, will provide all the security that is needed for this election to hold peacefully. But we need you and other bodies to continuously sensitize the people either through a program or face-to-face, -face, direct talk to them to see how they can come out. I believe we are going to provide adequate security for anybody who wants to exercise franchise on that particular day. From what um, the commissioner, the assurances the commissioner has given, uh, I think I'm satisfied with, with uh, their preparations. Uh, people are now generating hope. They are feeding themselves with good information that police has established that it will be peaceful. So I'm hopeful that the, uh, the election will come peaceful and nothing will happen to the people. I want to say to our young people, election no be war, right? Vote and not fight. Because if you kill yourself, the politician will remain. Your mother, your father that have trained you over years will be the one that will lose. So do not fight. Only vote. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.